Kendrick might have won this recent feud, but he isn't finished yet. According to insiders, Kendrick has enlisted Rihanna to help him expose Drake further on upcoming tracks. And who better than Rihanna to put Drake in his place? After all, it's only fair she checks him, especially since Drake dissed her and her partner ASAP Rocky on his last year's album for all the dogs. Drake made some pretty reprehensible comments about Rihanna, proving he's still bitter she never wanted him. But that's not all. There are new reports suggesting that Rihanna severed ties with Drake because she discovered his alleged inappropriate behavior. Are Rihanna and Kendrick really planning to take down Drake with their upcoming collaboration? What's this new evidence about Drake allegedly being a deviant? Let's break it down. It's been a while since Rihanna cut all contact with Drake. Despite moving forward with her life and having two adorable kids with ASAP Rocky, Drake still harbors bitterness from the rejection. Just when you think he might have let it go, Drake randomly disses Rihanna on his 2023 album, For All the Dogs, over six years after she cut ties with him. On the track Fear of Heights, Drake throws petty shots at Rihanna, disparaging her bedroom skills and bragging he's been with better women. This is embarrassing for Drake, considering his success. He should have better things to focus on than dissing a woman who rejected him nearly a decade ago and now has a family. Yet he also references ASAP Rocky in another song, another late night where he raps, I ain't pretty flacco, this is get really rocky. Some fans suggest Drake was just being Drake, stirring the pot for album attention. But seriously, isn't it a bit sad that an almost 40-year-old heavyweight in the music industry resorts to taking shots at women from his past just to keep his album in the headlines? He should let his music speak for itself without stirring up old drama. What's even more pathetic is Drake's well-documented infatuation with Rihanna. Despite publicly obsessing over her for years, he's now dissing her. Funny enough, while Drake was talking about love, Rihanna never publicly claimed him as her boyfriend. In fact, once their fling was over, she publicly stated she didn't want to be friends anymore. Rihanna and Drake first crossed paths in 2005 when Rihanna was in Toronto shooting the music video for Pondy Replay. Drake, bless his heart, claimed he was head over heels for her from that first meeting, obsessively talking about her in interviews. Despite Rihanna not reciprocating his affections, Drake remained infatuated. Rihanna started dating Chris Brown, and we all know how that story unfolded. During their relationship, Drake couldn't resist throwing shade at Chris at every opportunity. After Rihanna and Chris broke up, Drake started playing nice with Chris, even collaborating on a track together. In May 2009, Rumors about Rihanna and Drake dating started swirling after they were spotted on what looked like a date. Rihanna quickly shut down the rumors, clarifying she was just having fun with Drake and had no intentions of getting serious. Despite this, Drake continued to obsess over her. Drake and Rihanna collaborated on the hit song work, which Drake blew out of proportion, convinced that this time, Rihanna would stay. At the 2016 VMAs, Drake publicly professed his love for Rihanna while presenting her with the Vanguard Award. But based on her reaction, it's clear the feeling was not mutual. Rihanna later revealed in a Vogue interview that waiting through Drake's speech was the most uncomfortable part of the night. She also revealed they're no longer in touch and aren't friends. Drake, however, couldn't let go and confessed in a 2018 interview on LeBron James's HBO series, the shop that he always fantasized about starting a family with Rihanna. By then, Drake had already been distracted by Pusha T into claiming his son Adonis. While excited to be a father, he admitted he didn't get the fairy tale life he always dreamed of, which for him meant settling down and having a family with Rihanna. Despite never being publicly claimed by Rihanna, Drake thought she would settle down with him. Since being exposed for hiding a son, Rihanna has been 100% done with Drake. She took the high road and stopped mentioning him publicly. However, since Drake dissed Rihanna and Rocky on his latest album, Unprovoked, we're now hearing that Rihanna is ready to drop some truth bombs about Drake. She's reportedly teaming up with Kendrick Lamar to expose him. Twitter account Pop Stuff broke the news that Rihanna and Kendrick are working on new music seven years after collaborating on the Grammy-winning track Loyalty. But what exactly do they have left to expose about Drake? Kendrick already called Drake and his crew a bunch of certified PDF files. Will Rihanna help Kendrick double down on these allegations? 
We won't know for sure until they drop their music. However, word on the street is that Rihanna knows a lot about Drake's problematic behavior around women. This is allegedly the main reason she cut ties with him. Rumors about Drake being a creep are not new and there are videos of him getting handsy with young fans and texting Millie Bobby Brown when she was just 14. On top of that, fresh rumors and blind items are surfacing about Drake and his behavior around young women. In one blind item revealed by Crazy Days and Nights, it was suggested that Drake is following a 16-year-old girl on Instagram whom he has known since she was even younger. The details in this blind item are unsettling. In another incident, Drake allegedly paid a model $350,000 to settle an essay lawsuit in 2017. The model, Layla Lace, described the explicit details in her lawsuit, which Drake quickly swept under the rug. Kendrick emphasized multiple instances in his diss tracks that Drake consistently surrounds himself with individuals with criminal records. Notably, Kendrick mentioned Travis Savory, also known as Baka, a close associate of Drake who faced trafficking charges in 2014. Despite Baka's legal issues, Drake chose to bring him into the fold by signing him to his record label, Ovo Sound. This decision has sparked discussions about Drake's choices in association and the messages it sends to his audience and the wider public. With all these shady things swirling around Drake and the questionable company he keeps, it's enough to make anyone curious. While it's largely speculative at this point, there's often some truth to rumors when there's so much smoke. What's also puzzling is that despite nearly reaching 40 and spending two decades in the limelight, Drake has managed to keep his personal dating life remarkably private. Every woman linked to him seems to quickly disappear from the public eye, leaving us with more questions than answers. It's as if his fame acts as both a shield and a veil, allowing him to maintain an air of mystery amidst the constant scrutiny of his actions and associations. This elusive nature only adds to his enigmatic persona, making him a subject of endless fascination and speculation in the realm of celebrity gossip and beyond. Will Rihanna finally reveal more of Drake's dark secrets on her rumored new collaboration with Kendrick Lamar? Only time will tell. As anticipation mounts, even Drake's most loyal fans are starting to question his behavior, prompting discussions about whether an investigation might be necessary to uncover the truth. Ignoring these growing concerns could potentially lead to a situation reminiscent of the controversies surrounding R. Kelly, underscoring the importance of addressing such issues transparently and responsibly in the public eye. What are your thoughts on the potential Rihanna and Kendrick collaboration? Are you intrigued by the rumors? As for Drake, what do you think about the recent allegations surrounding his behavior? Drop your comments below, subscribe to our channel, and make sure to turn on the notification bell so you don't miss out on our next video.